Hey everybody, it's Sam here from the Inferno Gallade, and welcome back to Let's Play Little Big Planet. Last time we completed World Four, and we went to the, the Metropolis, and we raced the dude, but we lost the bag. His wheels, it was, and and it's in the subway now. So yeah, this time we're gonna go get said wheels in the subway. Holy macaroni! My car is sinking into the river. Take this lift to see where it goes. Now this is honestly a really cool. Now you do. Now you can reset if you want to get all these prize bubbles. Uh oh, the tide is taking it into the sewer edges. Jump onto the tray and you'll find a lift to take you down there. Now, before you want to do that, place this sticker here. And not only will I die, but you'll get a cool selection of things a new skin. And a freaking train. So, yeah. I realize these posters are around in the subway, but yeah, I wonder. Oh, oh. Here we go. You wanna do your best to jump over all of these. Especially the ones that are electric. As they, obviously, will cause a death. Uh oh. Okay. I think I got it. A big toast to my own mouth! Why is it I always get stuck on the electrical puzzles? No, seriously, every time I get to these electrical jumps up, I die every single time. At least all these were electrical. Wait. There we go. And talk about painful and annoying. Oh, no. No. Please don't let this pole be the death of me. Okay, that was anticlimactic. Time for a race. This one, you have not that much time. And getting the key here can be a real big pain in the butt. No, literally, it can. First, my car is in the sewage. Use the gravity to pull it out. Them's the switches right there. Check out the prize bubble in the boot. So you want to pinpoint it. It's like one of those core games, you know, that you play at the arcades. Yeah, it's like those. Except you're using it on a very large car that's been dumped in the sewers. Whoever that guy is, he's got subdued. 
The dude. The dude's been captured. I highly doubt that he'll be injured. See, it has the dude. Is awesome. Because he is the dude. Oh, oh look at that. We got Forger. We collected 25% of these special prize bubbles. Thanks for rescuing my wheels, man. Zadu got away and he's wrecking my construction site. Do this, everybody. Oh no. Zadu got captured, but he. But apparently he got loose of whoever that guy was. And now he's wrecking the construction site, so. Yeah, we've gotta stop him. Right then. Who's ready to wreck heck, the plans to wreck a construction site? Me, me, I am. Um... No, why did I press replay level? <laughs> oh darn! We're meant to return to the pod. I'm an idiot. So here it is, the last level of World Five. The construction site. And this, and the, we saved the best level for, for last in this video because, if you could already tell by the time the ball down there, because this is honestly my favorite level in the entire game. So there is vandalizing my construction site with his fireball machine. Fight him and stop him. Prepare for the greatest music track ever. It's a great song, alright. Right, got up here. But really, I love that song. It is only one of the best songs I ever heard. And I what? This was the first level I ever played in the series. Yeah, even before the intro stage and first steps. Excuse me for a sec. Okay, I am back. I feel like this might be the only time where I have to... Yeah. 
this level was nice enough to give you a second race. Oh yeah, if you die, you get sent back to the beginning of the race. That's pretty nice. Hold on. Managed to finish that race. A big basketball will try to crush you. Again, just make sure you don't run on, on its um, uh, bits where it's flaming. Those enemies are similar to the ones we we see in the canyons. Okay, there we go. So, here we go. Okay, so you beat me in the race, but you're out of luck, my friend. You won't get past my bouncers. So here we go with the next boss fight. Zadoo. The gimmick here is bounce is using bouncing mechanics. Bounce the fireballs into the bots of of his bouncers. His his first one will have one. The second one will have two. Now, with that, you, you would expect the dude to have three. Well, he only has one. However, he moves faster. But the tilt... And the battlefield will now tilt. And that does it for Zedo. You sure are a worthy for Take my private jet and go to Santa's Island for additional training. I like the voice I gave him. I don't know where I got it from. So yeah, we just beat the construction site. And we just defeated World 5. So yeah, we got a lot of new trophies on this episode as well. And that means we've unlocked World 6. The Islands, which is based off Japan. So, I think we'll call it a day here. Next time on Little Big Planet, we head to the islands and go through the Endurance Dojo for training for our Master Sensei. See you later.